He sends a bunch of hobs at you. Don't be threatened. They're a bunch of hobs. <laughs> hobs. Hobs, you know, they're not that threatening. You know, I probably shouldn't have slow timed, honestly, because that's going to make this take forever. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure um, in Flame... Well, why does my controller keep bleeping like that? Like, I don't know. My controller just keeps bleeping for no reason. Um, anyway. Yeah, just keep inflaming. I'm pretty sure it OKOs all hobs. How you doing? Um, yeah. Th that's why I need more, um, will potions. I spend it way too fast. Um, yeah. How you doing, Mr. Hobman? Owned. Hey! What are you doing alive? I said die! Erg. Okay. There we go. Now we got more hobs. Die! Die, denizens of the hob deep. And stuff. Erg. Okay, what? Why? Why are you still... Yeah, there we go. We're done. <laughs> Duff. What does that even mean? I don't even know what knackered means. What does it mean? Oops. <laughs> I keep forgetting to press A, you know? Pressing A. It's a pretty complicated concept. Um, so, now we're gonna head through this door here. And in this door contains, um, yeah, a really awesome place, which I love. Anyway, open this chest, and, um, you obtain a very hard-to-find item. Will use his dark, will use his dark, will use his dark, will use his dark. So then, yeah, you will use his dark, and, uh, yeah. Now what we're gonna do is we are going to go to, um, that one place with the... Dumb grandma that I don't like. BRB. Okay, now that we're at Rose Cottage, um, we can activate this demon door. You know, why not? Let's just unlock this demon door. Been on it. <laughs> Is it because you're fat? That's supposed to be, like, some kind of symbolism, I swear. So anyway, target the door. Like, target the demon door. Get a gift, and do not give him a, uh, a, um... Well, well, like, it won't hurt you in any way, but don't... Just don't do it. it it's a waste of time. Don't give him any gems or anything. G give him a red rose, chocolate, or a wedding ring. I'm gonna give him a red wedding ring. I do. <laughs> I can feel pebbles running up in my eyes. <laughs> ah, the innuendos. Okay. Open. Thank you. Anyway, the secret haven, um, is pretty awesome. <laughs> so anyway, you gotta find the chest, which is kind of hidden, so, you know, just look around a bit and you'll find it. There is a chest and you will get will users, will users, bright, everything. So... Yeah, you will users bright everything, and uh, now we are gonna go to um, the place right before you get to Twin Blades Camp, Abandoned Road. All right, at the Abandoned Road, um, this is why you need bright plate armor. This demon door here. So, <laughs> one of them are you. He's the oldest one, I think. Basically, you gotta show him three guys. <laughs> now, this is the one situation where I will take off my pimp hat. Because I have to. <laughs> So, basically, you gotta show him everything. Now, thankfully, I already have all the clothing and stuff. So, get your suits, get your... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Bright plate male suit. Also, I gave myself a haircut, and now I don't have a beard. So, talk to him. <laughs> Do you? 
And now you gotta show him the evil mage, which I will do. Equipment, clothing, suits, where is it? Dark will users. Now you talk to him. So an evil mage, a gallant knight, and a bandit. <laughs> that's pretty great, but <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I guess that's pretty great. So let's find the ball dress. So um, let's see, where is the bandit? There it is. You put on the full bandit gear. You got it earlier in the game. Talk to him. <laughs> You'd think he'd notice that there's only one guy, and yeah, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. Now, well, you know, I can. I'm gonna re-put on my awesome suit, you know, Archons and Pimp Hat, you know, because why not put on a Pimp Hat? Pimp Hat, it's pretty great. So, through the door. It's interesting to note that the map in this place looks like a smiley face in the loading time. So, there's lightning and stuff. <laughs> Open this, and you get the Doll Master's Mace. Now, that is a very, very, very good weapon for a mage. It's a very good weapon. And, uh, yeah, it just is. So now, for the final demon door, we are going to go, um, to the necropolis. And I'll be there shortly. Yeah, remember this place? So, yeah, now there's a bunch of enemies in here, and, um, I'm just gonna ignore them. Because I don't feel like facing them. Um, yeah, I honestly do not feel like facing them. So, anyway, go over here to where you where, to where we got the final uh, silver key to this demon door here. Now, I recommend doing this only after you've unlocked all of the silver key chest, chest gotten all the silver key, gotten all the silver keys, just everything. Heh <laughs> <laughs> now we have gotten all the silver key chests all the silver keys and let's just give them to him <laughs> so now we have zero silver keys <laughs> They even give you two warnings. <laughs> He's like, ahem, thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> now he has a silver... We just unlocked the final silver key door of the game, yay! This is quite possibly my favorite area in the entire game. Just look around for a second, alright? The water looks beautiful, like, this this lone sandy beach out in the middle of nowhere, that sunken ship in the background, that sunken ship over there with the fire, I just love this. Go over here and unlock the final chest we will unlock in this game, the Bereaver. You may notice this weapon on the back of certain bandits. It is a heavy weapon. And I don't like it, but, you know, I'm a completionist bastard, so I, you know, want to just get everything. It's very strong, though, and it has two open augment slots, so, when it comes with a health augmentation, so, it's pretty good. Like, it's pretty good for what it's worth. It's, um, you could put on two sharpening augmentations, and it'd be better than the Solus Greatsword, and, uh, yeah. So, um, now I'm just going to teleport to Archon Shrine. Now that we've done everything I wanted to do, and just, yeah, go to Archon Shrine and stuff. It's hard to believe that there's just one more episode to go, you know? Now, I've told some people this. I've told a lot of people this, actually. Um, what I will do after Fable... Sonic. I'm going to finish Sonic Adventure 2 Battle from where I left off, Episode 9. I just finished 8. So, yeah. Anyway, 
Now let's just go up here to where the bronze gate is. Stand on top of these stairs. And I will see you guys next time for the final episode of Fable The Lost Chapters.